It's been nearly 8 months since I started using the Bullets Wireless Z earphones from OnePlus and here is my experience with it so far. Hey everyone, welcome to Aesthetics and Winding. Today I'm going to address a few concerns uh, about these Bluetooth earphones from OnePlus. Let's get started. First thing, it always concerns me that these wireless earphones doesn't have a power button. Instead, you have to clip it together to turn it off and you need to unclip it to turn it back on. Uh, I have used some Bluetooth earphones in the past like the JBL Glide 120 which has a dedicated power button. The wireless C doesn't have one. The problem with this is that uh, whenever I clip the earphones together, it will turn off and uh, it will take uh, a three to five seconds to uh, get the connection back with my smartphone so it's not a big deal but uh, i think it is always better that the earphones stay connected even uh, if i clip it back for me it is taking around three to six seconds on my poco f1 uh, well it does cause the battery drainage to an extent but still uh, if i get a call i do not need to wait for another three to six seconds so that the bluetooth will con get connected my second concern is with the charging indication a few uses on my previous videos uh, based on the oneplus wireless c charging uh, commented that they are not getting an indication even if they kept it on charge for more than an hour for me i'm getting full charge if i kept it uh, for around one hour on my 18 watts charger so different users uh, users are having different experience even if they are using the original warp charger from oneplus itself so i think that needs to be fixed I think a simple firmware update can fix that issue and uh, if you ask me I still uh, keep it around 15 minutes to charge and uh, it will keep the battery well above uh, 100 percent not 100 percent 90 percentage which my phone displays as uh, 100 percentage. Now my third concern which is not much of a big deal is that uh, they should have covered or included a rubber flap to cover the USB-C charging port. I mean the Glide 120 uh, Bluetooth earphones that I used previously does had a uh, rubber flap to make it completely water resistant. Although the wireless C is rated as water resistant, uh, I think the inclusion of a rubber flap uh, or something to cover the port would have been nice. Last but not least, the earphones are made out of plastic and it does get uh, scratched. If it was a metal built, the scratches won't be there and it would have been uh, looking good. So these are my experience so far with the wireless Z earphones. Other than these, the headphones are exceptional. I still use it i'm totally satisfied with these the battery backup is amazing so that's about it guys i hope you enjoyed this video thanks for watching stay safe see you in the next one